Good evening everyone, Blind Audio Tech Review here today. We're going to show you how to pair your QBrail XL to your computer, laptop specifically, with NVDA, non-visual desktop access. <clears throat> Let's get started. So first we're going to, you know, turn on the QBrail. Mine's already turned on, so we're going to go to the you know, it's gonna start up and then it's gonna be the first thing it's probably gonna display is notepad. And so you wanna press C or space till you find connections. And then it's going to show you connect connection Bluetooth, connection USB. Sorry, I said those wrong. <laughs> connection USB, connection Bluetooth Braille, connection Bluetooth keyboard. Don't mind, um, don't mind the key keyboard Bluetooth. We'll get to that later. So right now we're going to do Bluetooth Braille. Press enter on that. It's going to take us to pairing mode, Braille Edge, and then it's going to be five numbers at the end, zero, zero, four, five, eight. In my case, um, that's to tell apart their key Braille from other key Braille. Say in the, you say you have multiple. Cube rails, like you know, it's gonna tell yours apart. So that's the cube rail side, and now we're going to jump on the laptop. Starting from the desktop, we're going to show you how to pair it with the Bluetooth, right? I'm gonna go Start to window, Cortana window, sir. Going to go to the Cortana, the search box, type in S E T S E T settings, settings, press enter, settings, set. I'm gonna press tab for List. system the system and you wanna look for devices. So red arrow. Devices to a thirteen. I'm gonna find devices and you're going to press enter. Um one thing I'm warning you now, I apologize if the visuals are not, you know, the best. This is meant for blind uh blind accessibility. No further ado, let's continue. Enter. Settings window. Bluetooth and then you're gonna press tab. List Bluetooth and other devices one of eight. It's Bluetooth and other devices, so it's already checked. Um, press tab. Add Bluetooth or other device button. Now you want to make sure that Bluetooth is on. You know, like going here. Bluetooth toggle button pressed. So it says Bluetooth toggle button pressed. It's already it's already on. But if it's not, then you press space. It turns it on. Press shift tab because it's already on for me. Add Bluetooth or other device button. And it's going to go to add Bluetooth and other device. So I'm going to press enter. Add a device. Windows. And it's going to display. Why everything can Bluetooth button mount. You want to click on Bluetooth, mice, and you know, etc. Press enter. Cancel button. Okay, you know, press tab. List. Braille edge. Okay, you're going to press it several times until you hear list. And then now it's displaying devices available. In my case, I'm going to select. Hmm, why? Well, yeah, okay, press tab if it doesn't Cancel work. Cancel button list. Braille edge 00458, not selected one of one. Okay, it's gonna. Braille edge 00458, check on your display. Mine is Braille edge 00458, that's correct. I'm gonna go ahead and press enter on that. Selected. Because that's your device. While it's setting up. Give it a couple of seconds. Done button. Box okay, cursor. it's you know set up. Now we're gonna press enter. Settings. Settings. And it takes us back to the setting page. Notification from settings. Devices ready. Braille edge zero zero four five eight feet is set up and ready to go. Window. All right. So now the device is ready. You know, set up. I press press Alt F Alt F four to close out of this window. Task bar. And now we're going to go to the desktop. Folder view list. And here you want to press insert N, caps lock N, any hotkey that gets you to the NVDA menu. In my case, it's caps lock N. NVDA menu. Um, it's now you can. Uh, it's in the NVDA menu. You want to go to preferences. Preferences submenu P. You want to do a right arrow. Settings S. Settings, you want to press enter on that. NVDA settings, general, normal configuration. All right, it's going to be general, 
keyboard and all that fun stuff. And we're looking for Braille. Speech 2 of 12. Braille 3 of 12. All right, Braille. Press tab on that. Braille property page. Braille display grouping. Braille display edit read only multi-line alt plus D. No Braille. And now it's saying no Braille, but we're going to change that. We're going to press tab again. Change button alt plus H. Now it's, you know, change. Press space on this. Space select Braille display dialog. Braille display. Combo box no Braille. We're going to look for hymns. Because Q Braille is from him, so we're going to look for that. Super Braille, Seeker Braille, Pepenma, Eel Braille, X Older, Pepenma, Eel Braille, X New Ramada, MDV Lily. Humanware Braille, NPI, Slash Beast, Humanware Braille Note. Hymns Braille Sense, Slash Braille Age, Slash Smart Beetle, Slash Sync Braille Series. Ah, there we go. Braille, hymns, you know, press, press tab on that. Powered, combo box automatic. And you can leave it on automatic, but if you really want to make sure that it's going to pair, like, you know, Make sure it's going to connect. Go find your device by pressing down arrow until you hear com device, the number. Here, let me show you. Bluetooth. Blue, Bluetooth serial. Bluetooth, Bluetooth serial. Com 18. Bluetooth serial. Com 20. Braille age 00458. There you go. See? Bluetooth serial. Com 20. Braille edge 00458. This might vary, but, you know, it's going to be along the lines of Bluetooth. Bluetooth serial com number and then your um you know your braille edge braille edge and then you know, the number that belongs to it. I'm gonna press enter on that. Actually you wanna press tap, sorry. Okay button. You wanna hit okay. MVDA and sounds. when you yeah. hear that, you know, the the sound to them and you know that means it's connected. And you should start to uh read braille off uh, the display when it says select braille no um caution this is for the new nvda you know i'm not sure if it works on older models models i'm sorry i haven't tried that but this is how you pair your q braille xl to your laptop using nvda um on the next video i show how to pair it using you know pair it with hybrid mode. Thank you for, you know, stopping in. If this is helpful, please hit subscribe or like, you know, I don't really much, don't care. Um, if you have any questions, comment down below. Y'all have a good day. Peace out. Stop. Stop record button.